In 1907, the Vernal Uinta Tabernacle was dedicated by then LDS President Joseph F. Smith. During Smith's remarks, he said to those gathered, he would not be surprised if the day would come when a temple would be built in your own midst here. Over the years, the building fell into disrepair and at one time was even up for sale. That all changed when... I'm not sure what year it was, but they came out together in their cowboy hats and their cowboy boots, and they stepped across the temple. This was the old tabernacle, and they stepped across the floor of the tabernacle. President Hinckley turned to Monson, I guess, says, it'll do. And so that's when the first time that it started announcing that there'll probably be a temple out here. The temple was dedicated in 2007. It's the first temple built from an existing building. When constructing the tabernacle and converting it to a temple, the bricks came from the local area. These bricks are locally manufactured here, up here in the canyon. As the bricks deteriorated over time, the community took action. They had homes out here in the valley that was uh, built with the same bricks. The whole valley went out there and tore these homes down and they refurbished the bricks, saved the bricks and stacked them. From old homes to a new temple, each brick is a slice of vernal history. They have to go in and replace any of the bricks because of the stone being soft. They just cut it out and insert a new brick. In Vernal, Utah, I'm Robin Seville. Good for Utah.